Starting off, I'm taking my Glamouflage Concealer by Hard Candy and just concealing any blemishes that I feel need to be concealed. Then taking my Maybelline Fit Me Foundation Stick in 115, I'm just concealing under my eyes and any other like redness spots or wherever I get red and then blending it in with a small stippling brush. To set my makeup, I'm taking my Rimmel Stay Matte, which is powder sucks, I don't recommend it, but I still use it, and I'm just buffing it over my skin with my Kabuki brush. Taking this light brown color from my Maybelline Sunbaked Neutrals palette, I'm just filling in my eyebrows wherever it's pretty sparse because last time I got my eyebrows done, they kind of jacked up my eyebrows. So I'm just filling in the spots that need to be filled in. Next, I'm taking my e.l.f. clear mascara, I don't know, and just setting my eyebrows with it so that the color stays in place and they don't move around. Then I'm taking my e.l.f. blush and bronzing duo and obviously using the bronzing side and just bronzing or contouring the hollows of my cheeks and the sides of my nose. To make sure I stay shine free all day, I'm using my Urban Decay All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray and spraying it all over my face and letting it dry. Then I'm using my Too Faced Shadow Insurance and priming my eyes for my eyeshadow. First, I'm taking this Yabby eyeshadow in Shell and I'm just putting it on the inner corners and um, focusing on my eyelids and not really on my outer corner because a darker color is going to go there. And also underneath my eyebrows. If I lose myself tonight, it'll be by your side. If I lose myself tonight. Then 
am mixing these two colors from my Sunbaked Neutrals palette and this dark shimmery navy color from Coastal Scents on a big blending fluffy brush from e.l.f. and just you can see how I'm blending it in and focusing it on my outer V and blending it into my crease. Then I'm taking the same color I used on my eyebrows to just put it on a blending eye brush to blend the colors in and make it a little bit less harsh. Then I'm lining my eyelids with my L'Oreal Liquid Linear Intense Eyeliner and just drawing a thin line because, and I want to wing it out, but I don't know how to wing it out, so I just kind of draw a line, you know. While I let my liquid liner dry, I'm taking my Rimmel Scandalize Eyeliner in Sparkle Black and lining my waterline and also tight lining. I'm taking the same sparkling navy blue shadow and using a smudging brush and just smudging the eyeliner on my waterline to make it stay all day and just give it more of a smoky effect. Now I'm curling my eyelashes. We'll stay to a I'm taking my CoverGirl Lash Blast Length Mascara and just using this as kind of a primer for my next mascara which I'm going to use because this just separates your lashes and keeps them separated because, you know, Sometimes mascara gets a little clumpy. This is my Voluminous Carbon Black Mascara by L'Oreal and it kind of gets a little clumpy. That's why I used the other one before it. So I also have to like scrape some of it off from the wand, but then I'm just putting it on my eyelashes because it makes them look so big and so beautiful. So yeah, and then when I'm done with this, my look is going to be complete.
So this is the final eye look, and I'm in slow motion so that you can really see it because then my camera died. But as you can tell, it's a little smoky, but I really like it. It's like wearable smoky because it's not too dark, and it highlights my eyes, and I really like the mascara. So hope you enjoy it, and have an awesome day. Bye!